In the plant profile series of videos, today we will look at growing cayenne pepper. Cayenne is a hot chili pepper used to flavor dishes. I find cayenne pepper to be hot but not too hot at the same time. It tastes great when it's fresh as well as when it's dried and powdered. So here is a pepper plant. This pepper plant is from Bonnie Plants. This is available at most uh, home improvement stores, garden stores. The kind of soil that peppers need is moist soil that's evenly watered most of the time. A lot of nutrients which you can get by adding compost and you also need hot weather. Peppers need warm or hot climates to thrive. So summers is a good time to plant peppers. So this is our cayenne pepper plant. It's growing pretty well. The peppers are becoming larger every day. And although this pepper looks large, you should wait for some time to harvest it because the cayenne peppers do grow very big. And you can see that in the upcoming sections of the videos that the cayenne pepper does become big and does produce a lot. The cayenne pepper is in fact one of the most prolific pepper plants you can grow. So as you can see, this is our first harvest from this pepper plant. The supports that we will be using to support our pepper plants is the Altamero cage. The Altamero cage is a great way to support your pepper plants as well as tomato plants. And I had done a video review for this Altamero cage. You can see that video review by clicking on the link on your screen. And if you want to know more about what kind of fertilizers to add for the pepper plants and what kind of watering schedule the pepper plants need, do check out the video on your screen for a lot of other details. So as you can see the cayenne pepper plant is producing a lot of peppers, big sized peppers. And for the plant of this size, this is a lot of peppers that the pepper plant is producing. And what I really like about the cayenne pepper plant is it just keeps growing very well throughout the growing season. Almost no insects attack this pepper plant. And the heat of the cayenne pepper is just about perfect for a variety of dishes that you can make. As you can see this pepper is really large. It's overflowing the palm of my hand all the way to my wrist so that's a long pepper. And you can keep harvesting the cayenne pepper throughout the season. They just keep producing peppers all through. And a general rule with pepper plants is that the more peppers you harvest, the more the plant will produce. It's just a survival instinct of the plant to keep producing more fruits so that it goes into seed and that's how it promotes its generations. So as you can see within a few days you keep getting more and more peppers produced by the plant. So a single pepper plant is actually quite a lot if you look at the number of peppers it provides. You do not really need a lot of peppers unless you're cooking something really hot or making a lot of buffalo sauce or something like that. I always like growing the cayenne pepper plant just because of its abundant harvest. From a single plant as you can see you can keep harvesting a lot of peppers. So I'd like to know from you my YouTube subscribers. What kind of peppers do you like to grow? Do you like to grow really hot peppers like serrano or cayenne or even hotter peppers? There are a lot of hot peppers out there. Or do you like the milder ones like jalapenos, red 
or green uh, bell peppers I'd like to know from you so do let me know drop in a comment and if you like this video do give me a thumbs up so here is the plant profile chart for cayenne pepper So I hope you like this video. I'll see you again soon. Happy gardening.